Hey there guys, this is Flamzeron, aka YouTube's Tosuke, and today I'm going to show you a cool game. It's for the PS2. And everyone loves PlayStation. I'll just go ahead and say, sorry if my audio sounds a little weird. Checking memory card. This game includes disturbing content and scenes of graphic violence. Sorry if my audio sounds, my commentary sounds a little weird. I got a new preamp made by Capcom, a weird version of Capcom. What did Slenderman take over this? Produced by Capcom. Directed by Kenji Fukasaku. Actually, I had enough time to read that. Ew. But yeah, I got a new preamp, so the static issue should be gone. From what I can tell. But. Creepy place. Creepy newspaper. Oh. Oh boy. I suppose this dark gentleman here is going to be our friend. Maybe he's the protagonist. Or maybe not. Yeah, I don't think so. I think he is setting this place on fire. To make a tower? Dare I say it? You know what kind of tower it is. It's none other than... Clock Tower 3. This is the final of the Clock Tower games. Technically. Little creepy music here. It's been a while since I've played this, but this is actually the first Clock Tower game I ever played. And it's the one that got me into the series. Clock Tower 3. Let's see what we got here. Configure. Okay. No real, uh. I'll have to remember that one. But sound. Everything should be fine, honestly. Play, playing this one on my PS2 like I did the last one, though I am getting my PS3 back relatively soon. Don't need to worry about that. Martha. Don't need to worry about that because I'm pretty sure I can make it brighter anyway. I kind of hate that about games where some games just like, with the brightness, it's just like, oh, just adjust your TV. Which I think is kind of dumb because, like, why would you want to adjust it just for one game? But anyway, it's Clock Tower 3, the last of the Clock Tower games, and will thus be bringing an end to this Clock Tower commentary series that I've been doing save for one game which I'll talk about in the recap which I'll obviously do and since this is the last one I'm also going to make this one kind of long because not only will it be the last clock tower commentary but it might be my last one for a while due to other plans but yes this is Capcom so we don't need to see that again we definitely don't want to see that spoilers but this is Capcom's. We're going to go ahead and get started. We are playing as Alyssa, a British schoolgirl who is 14 going on 15. 
And by going on 15, I mean today's her fucking birthday. So happy birthday, Alyssa. Hope you had a good friggin' birthday. Alyssa, how have you been? I think of you every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life at boarding school. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six years without giving you any explanation. It must have been very painful for you, and I'm sorry, but it was for your own protection. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching, and I fear your life may be in danger more than ever before. Please go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your love okay. Mother, Nancy. Mum. Alyssa! You're wanted on the British telephone. voice acting your mother. with very Hello? Japanese Mom? style Hello? actual Are acting. Hot traffic. Answer me. Hello? Hello? Mom? Hello? Mom? Mom? Answer me. <laughs> I must hurry home. <coughs> I'm assuming this is the first time she's come home in a long time. Even Japanese style bag. Mom? I'm back. I mean, I know it's a tote, but. Mom? No. Okay. <laughs> One thing I'll go ahead and note this game has very strong audio cues, so you'll, when you're playing this, you have to keep that in mind. You'll get to see a fair amount of this game anyway, so. <laughs> hey, it's that dark gentleman we um, saw earlier. Excuse me. Are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. That was early yesterday morning. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back. At all. Oh, so my. it's just you. You are all alone in this world now, little girl. <laughs> rape, 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 <laughs> rape. Sister, Lisa. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Get away from me. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. That's actually kind of weird. How she's just like, lol. Her little movements are kind of weird. Now, this is similar to, like, uh, Silent Hill. The th oh, no. S sort of, they, they do a better job with it. As you can tell, though, this is not a point-and-click game. This is actually just a regular survival horror game. The light from the fire casts a reddish glow, but it's still sort of like a adventure-like game. It's more just done like a 3D. It's kind of like the uh, Strong Bad games on the PS3 versus the Wii or the PC, where you actually move around with the stick. Except there's a uh, uh, text cues to tell what you can touch. And, uh, hold on. She can crouch like that. Oh no, I need to take a poo. Ploop! That's immature humor for the day. But, anyway. So you just click around. It's the chair that strange gentleman was sitting in. So we just go out here. This is the save point. A diary lies open with an incomplete entry. You can save game data here. No shit, I just told you that. No or not. Or it looks like it to me. 
It, or it did. She walks around. This this is another one, isn't it? A strange pattern adorns the jar. It is brimming with fresh water. That's a heal point, I think. But let's see what else can we look at. Chairs. But uh yeah, this is the girl we play as Alyssa and you can totally see my um little uh uh Delio here. Schoolgirl. I kinda like how her uniform looks like she's been wearing it for a while. I mean, obviously she went to boarding school, so she's been kinda stuck in that for a while, but I don't know. To me I, to me it just kinda looks I think it's a nice touch. I don't know. Can we leave? There's no need to go out now. I have to find Mum. Okay, let's go up here. Maybe, uh... Wait, are we allowed to go over here? Oh, okay, that's... Hold on. This game has kind of interesting camera. There we go. Nothing of interest here. Yeah, okay. I'm going to be here for a while, so... Dunk, 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 dunk. Doink, 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 doink. No, go back up the stairs, you little duty head. Okay. Let's be upstairs. Doink, 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 doink. You know. All that good junk. What's on the... M Does it, the map even do anything? Select. So we're right there and we have no idea what's going on. Kind of, sort of. Basically, I do not know. But so we're just supposed to kind of go upstairs and you know reasons Lol. Yeah. Sorry about that. That was totally me just stalling, but the audio kind of cut out on me, and as you can tell, there is, as I said, there's audio cues. Nothing of interest here. We don't want to go into Philip's room because it said Philip. Alyssa. Can we go in there? Yes, we can. Dink, 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 dink. It's my room. I feel like getting naked and just getting my freak on. Place. My room. Nothing's changed. Worn books stand neatly in line. It's her bed. Not a speck of dust. Mum must have cleaned it for me. She sure did. <clears throat> This is another way to get into the room. This is, what, their living room? Look at the fire. 
I'm just gonna sit here and watch the fire all day. But, don't wanna waste too much time. Let's go over here. This is, no. I know what I'm supposed to do, but, you know, the camera angles do kind of screw things up a little bit because they kind of just change. Over here, it's a room we can't go to. Ow. Lightning. The panic meter. Whenever Alyssa is feeling um, physically or emotionally threatened, the panic meter rises. When the panic re meter reaches max, Alyssa falls into a state of panic. While in a state of panic, Alyssa's movements are restricted. And if attacked while in a state of panic, she will die. The panic meter reading will be go down slowly if Alyssa relaxes in a safe place. Always keep an eye on the panic meter and try to minimize stress whenever possible. She could fix it by masturbating, but, you know... I don't want to get my uniform dirty. Mm. Oh no, the fire. <clears throat> Interesting. The trick, yeah, the trick to getting down um stuff is to uh Just kind of chill. Mm. I'm scared. I'm going to clutch my chest like a Japanese woman. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no, the head thing fell. Dunk. 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 Uh oh. That looks like a bottle and a litter down there. Sacred bottle. That's holy water. We're going to use that to get away from people. Name it litter. Nancy's litter. Dearest Alyssa, I wanted nothing more than you for. I wanted. I wanted nothing more than for you to live peacefully. But if you're reading this now, you must have come back to the house. For your protection, I am giving you some advice, as well as instructions on how to use this bottle of holy water. Holy water uses 1. Exorcism. If, you, if, you, if ever you are threatened, sprinkle some holy water on your assailant. It will cause them to halt temporarily. 2. Destroying sigils. To break the seals that prevent access to certain places, sprinkle holy water on them. Replenishing holy water. Always remember that the holy water you have is not in and limitless supply. You can refill your bottle from either one, sacred jars, or two, lion drinking fountains. You'll see those a good amount. Sentimental items and spirits. A person who has died of unnatural causes has unfinished business in the living world. In order to protect yourself, you must work to heal their wounds. And to do so, you must find their sentimental item. Lastly, this is all my fault. But I will do my best to protect you. Please remember that I love you more than anything else in the world, and I always will. Mum. Aww. Mommy. Go over here. Duck down. So now that we've got that dealio, we can, uh, we can sprinkle stuff. Actually, Hold on just a second. Sorry about that. Something came up, but uh, it should be fine now. So, it seems like the audio is back. I guess it'll just kind of do its thing. Wrong way. But yeah, we've now got a holy bottle thing. Would you do triangle, I think? We just go up to it and go, yeah! Because like I said, this game has 
audio cues that I would miss out on if I can't actually hear anything. But this one seems to be the game that people think of when they hear Clock Tower. Like, if you look up, like, Clock Tower fan fiction or fan art or whatever, this is, or even cosplay, this is the one that people usually go to. And you'll often see Alyssa mainly in her uniform. People do it different ways. The old door has been barred, boarded up. I can't remember the store even. I can't remember the store ever having been opened. Good question. Whose restroom? Weird. Can we go in it? Someone's behind that door. I think that's another level. This pl this place is immaculately blah blah blah. blah. Clean. I don't know how to speak the English language. Nancy, we're gonna go in here. Dun 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 dun. Okay. The three way mirror has been folded up. Mum's bed. M must have left in a hurry. The wardrobe door is still open. I'm going to wear my mother's clothes and pretend that I'm her. The clock has stopped. You need special the baga. You need special winding keys to get it working again. Who's in that who is that in the portrait? It's been there forever. Computer. There is a computer on this desk. I wish I had one too. I imagine she has one at her dorm room, maybe. But yes, if you couldn't tell, this is all motion capture. Mom, I came back home. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mom? What? Oh. My favorite book. Lord of the Rings. No. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about with Japanese acting. If you ask me. We don't even have a piano in the house. What the Who's fuck? And people love this song too. Ooh. Looks like we came out somewhere different. Welcome to my favorite level in this game. How lame, because it's the first. Indeed. I want to go back, though. The door is... is it. My tongue's a little dry, so... There we go. The door is sealed shut. It's like five in the morning when I'm recording this. So. This place is fucking weird. It's Yeah, 
Yeah, I'd hide in there too. This is during World War II, I think. Dead person. It's the TARDIS. Is that Doctor Who? He'll help us. Her skirt is so short. Oh no. No. The ring. Give me back my ring. Okay. Stop it. Gerd. Engage your ring. Okay. Spiritual healing. When you find a sentimental item that belongs to a person who died of unnatural causes, return it to its rightful owner. If it is a ring, put it, put it in its case. If it's a half heart pendant, put it together with the other half. By returning these sentimental items, spirits are healed, and Alyssa may obtain another item or valuable information in return. Just kind of making sure the audio is working. Okay. That explosion. But he looks like as though he was burned by something. An empty box ring. A ring box. Did someone steal the ring from him? I have the ring right here. You kluka kluk. How do I put the... Maybe it's this? How do I... Bloodstained engager ring. Did someone drop it? Ugh. I think you have to be in the right area. Hiya! Yes, use the item. I am healed. Thank you. Item! Sigil stone. Makes me think of oblivion. You're gonna hear that a lot too. The music's just going to stop. That's due to, um... This is that lion thing I was telling you about. It's a drinking fountain shaped like a lion. You can save game data and game data and refill your holy water bottle here. Or refill. And just for shits, I'll save. Just in case. You get eight slots... Because that's symbolism that there are eight games now. I don't really know what the symbolism is behind the numbers. That's probably just like, oh, we're just going to give you eight because reasons. That took a while. Well, let's save. And no, yeah, like I said, audio cues. This game is all about the audio. Which is why I want to hear it as much as I can. I can hear a piano. Is it coming from that hall over there? Indeed it is. Okay. 
هيا You broke the seal Now we can go down there There's something. Yep. Item. Gold fountain pen. Okay. Yep, there's a spurt over there. Okay. This one I don't even remember knowing how to do, honestly. It's covered in bloodstains. A victim's belongings? The entry begins, My darling. Must be addressed to her fiancé. Okay. Very clearly, we use the friggin' pen over here. Thank you. Yay. Invisibility band. That'll be useful. Okay. Continue onward over here. Yeah, we can go down here. I don't know what purpose it would serve, because we're... Yeah, exactly. Well, can we scoot? Well, you know, we can. I don't remember actually having done doing that before. Let me get the fucking item. Oh, my God. Just get up. You, you, can, you can get up now, if you want. Lavender water. What does that do again? What does the lavender water do? Oh, it alleviates panic. Wait. No. This will be useful so we can get hurt. So there's that, so... Only other option would be to go in here. This tailor shop. Though there are expensive looking suits on display. Eh. Don't want to spend too much of it. Let's go inside. Tree with decorations. Today must be Christmas Day. Things all over the place. Dad's letter. Dear Mary, how are you? I am now in France, in a region known as Champagne. I don't know. Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce French words. You'll have to forgive me. It is a beautiful place with vin with vineyards as far as the eye can see. When the war is over, we must come here together for a holiday. I hear that they have organized I hear that they have organized for blackouts in London now. I am sure you are fine during the day as Jane is there, but I worry about you being alone at night. You'll be alright, won't you, darling? Keep warm with love, Daddy. <laughs> seems to be locked from the other side. How unfortunate. See, so you can hear the sound of the broken glass. That's also pretty. This game actually has a decent amount of audio. Delio. Can't talk about the suits. Clearly used for hiding. I want to note that that's not always going to work. You can actually be forced out of it. Most, you know, makes sense. Okay, let's go up here. Is 
so it's noteworthy with all the sound stuff going on. Do I really want to go in here, though? I Let's check the other room, room first. I do know what I'm doing in this one. It's, it's not blind. That one I'm definitely supposed to go into later on, so. Like I said, I'm just going to make this one as long as I want. And I don't even care about having to splice in parts and whatnot. It's locked and will not open. Dun, 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 dun. Christmas tragedy. Young pianist brutally murdered. Christmas Day, 1942. Paul Mall. May Norton, age 12, was found murdered in Norton's The Tailor. She was discovered by Norton family nanny Jane Stride, who returned home to find the victim unconscious, bleeding from the head. An autopsy has revealed that it was an instantaneous death, caused by a blow to the skull with a heavy, blunt object. No subjects have been named. The victim had taken part in the 15th annual piano concours at the Victoria Hall in Kensing Kensington the previous day. A consummate p p p p uh, pianist, Miss Norton, was widely tipped for a first prize, but an, an unfortunate error in her performance prevented her from taking the crown. May have May had been living at home alone since her father, William Norton, a serving officer. Return to the front in July. <laughs> How unfortunate. I must save him. Oh, really? Alisa. Evade points and hide points. When Alyssa is fleeing from an enemy, certain predetermined areas may start to glow. These are evade points and hide points. Approach the area and press the search button to make Alyssa take evasive action or repel her attacker. Note that most evade points can only be used once. It's kind of like the, uh... Yeah, wasn't there a scene in the struggle with him with a chair? Or is it this game? I can't remember. Press the search button when in, in front of a hide point and Alyssa can take refugee there. The camera will switch to a first person view while hiding. Hide points can usually be used repeatedly, but if the panic meter reaches max while in hiding, Alyssa will run out of her from her hiding place. Always keep in mind, keep an eye on the panic meter while hiding. This is very true. Run! Shit! Fuck! It is sealed off with barbed wire. Can't open this without a tool. Shit! No! Ha! Uh, I did that deliberately. Run back. Yeah, he's running. Okay. Faster, you little shit poop. Go, you. Okay, run out. Then I'm gonna. I have a, I have a strategy. So you run out, music playing, but you hear that? You're mine now. You climb under here and run. Oh, you fucker. Okay, let's get back. 
Okay, get up, get up, get up, get up. Dude, woman, get up, you son of a... Too late. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be cutting it a little close, but I'm not sure what I got the holy water. Gonna be running here. Run, run, run. And hide in here. He sees us, yeah, but... And him not know where we are. There's one hiding spot that may be unintentional. But the first little sound. Okay, let's go back here. I want to try to avoid stepping on the glass. But yeah, you can tell this game takes a lot of audio cues, so you need to be careful about life. Let's go in here. Oh, shit. Eh. Let's try it. Eh. Yeah, we need to fucking get more shit. Ugh. Gonna make some noise, and then the douche bagel's gonna be all like, I hear you. Unless we're super quiet. Now, I'm pretty sure he's still in the house, which is why... I mean, the encounters, I, I'm pretty sure, are random, but... Whoa, I was not paying attention. That was just all herp. Go up here. I'm gonna get more stuff. I know this is kind of a long way, but like I said, this one's gonna be kind of long in general. Oh boy. No, 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 don't. No, I did not say save. I don't even know where the douchebag's coming from. Here, we fill that. He's most likely coming from the other way, but... Or he's near. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I'm gonna try and juke him out. I'm going to kill myself! Bitch. And don't you just love it how I was so far away? I think they made her intentionally slower. Okay, gonna go hide in the spot. We're a good bit away, so... We can just literally wait for him. He may catch us while we're trying to get there, but... Go in, go in, go in. Oh my god, yes. Yes. I'm sweating through my uniform. I better strip naked. He won't mind, I hope. We were extremely lucky. Because, like I said, he can find us, even if we're... Even if we're just kind of shitting around, being all like, Herp, derp, I'm hiding in here. Because obviously, you know, like in real life, if the person you're you're being chased by sees you, then obviously you're gonna get you're gonna get 
caught. But now that I've got more holy water, should be able to do things. And I've actually gotten to the final level, the final boss in this game. So in the recap, I'll go in more detail about the story a little bit. Right now, I'm just kind of playing the game. I'm sure if you run back and forth on the uh, broken glass, you'll probably... Sorry that I'm kind of jerking around. It's just that the camera kind of confuses me a little bit. Let's go inside. It's the clitoris room. What's this? Oh, a key. This must be the owner of the house. Hmm, there's a key next to it. Red drawer. Okay, that'll be useful. I remember I got stuck here, and I'm just like, eh. Fire. Wonderful. More than enough books on the classics here. This desk, the desk is clean and well organized. Because my butt! Now we has to be careful. And I'm pretty sure there's a chair. Th I, I don't remember. I don't remember. One of the drawers is locked. Use Yes, I will use the key. May's room key. Okay. So, we can now go in that one room that's just all like, lol. Let's not let her go in. Yeah, we'll use the key. Go inside. There's a diary. I was about to say, you better let me actually get that maze diary. 5th December. Today I darned Daddy's socks and sewed a, sewed a button on his shirt. He calls himself a tailor, but he can't even mend his own clothes. Please, Daddy, I'm not your wife. 15 December. Only a few more days until the concours, and I still can't play it perfectly. What am I to do? I know Daddy is wishing me well from far away, so I must try my very best. Don't worry, Daddy. I'll make you proud. How unfortunate. Letter. Invitation. Okay, so... Mm. Alisa. Yes, there's a reason why he knows her name. Escape route's been blocked. What do I do? I'll tell you what you do. I mean, you could always jump out the window. Fucking chair! Yeah, I guess this is the uh, scene I was talking about. Go back in sight, you... Woman. Okay, well, is there anything else I need to do in here? It's a small child's bed. I'm going to pee on it. <gasps> He's not there. It's dated 1942. Where is this? Eh. Thought I saw something shine. Just kind of clicking around. Guestbook and some papers are scattered around. Good for you. Another entrance. Kind of a easy way to get out. Invita 
location. There is one area we haven't been able to go to yet. It's this way. Alisa. Shut up. I'm scared. I'm peeing. Let's go over here. Because Fountain of Lions. Thank you. It's over here. A dead end. Oh no. What will I do? Quickly. Okay. Don't even care to go to the other side. Oh, just disappeared. He's just like, I don't want to be here. Even though he's going to show up at this very spot later on. A leaflet. Christmas Eve, 1942. Fifth annual piano concours. I have an invitation. I'm allowed to go in. Oh my fucking god. I just had a thought. What if Alyssa was so scared that she was having uncontrollable gas? Butterflies. She's locked in. She cannot get out. Save point. A diary light. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, whatever. Because even if I die, I might want to continue with the story. Oof. Hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am, because I actually really like this game. Of course, I used an FAQ for the most part, so I'm just like, Clock, Cloak room lockers with combination locks. One of them is locked. You get a chance to try to unlock it. I don't remember the password. Oh, things. Lavender water. Yay. What's on this side? Nothing. Let's go inside the concert hall. The music just stops. Cutscene time. Ooh. <laughs> I think it's funny how she just kind of dances all over the stage. It's like, this is my show. And like she rips off her uniform and under it's like this costume. I have to keep playing. Now watch this. What the fucker? Okay. Okay, let's do this. Then this. Reminds me of that one game, that that one Flash game, Crisis Core, that's on my website of Zach doing his stinking sit-ups.
Believe it or not, this is actually a hiding spot. Even if he sees you coming through here. This lever must rise and lower the stage device. Dead person. It scared her too. Torso has been crushed. What a horrible death. He's holding something. A note of scribbled a note of scribbled on a tiny scrap of paper. Same combination bad. Uh -huh. Ten fourteen equals babe. Thirty four oh three equals dead. Yeah, okay. Mm right. I see it's a code. Seems easy. I can open that safe. Most likely. I don't think it's going to let me open it just yet, but I can. The piano is dripping with blood. Oh no. This seems to be off limits. Well, I better not. You know, you would think it must require a special key. Okay, I I think I know what to do. But go over here, and then you have to do the safe. Let me look at it one more time. Manager notes. Okay, so it's B A D bad. B is one, A is zero, and D is three. So it's one oh three. Right? Yes, it is one oh three. One oh three. One oath. Well, I can just do that. Aya. Where's in there? Master key. Okay. That'll help us. We should probably go ahead and s save. But again, sorry that I keep kind of jerk. It seems like I'm kind of jerking around a little bit whenever the camera changes. It's it kind of thrown me off a little bit. Haven't played this in a while. I don't remember Alyssa being this slow. And yes, if you're if you're confused, uh, thanks to the translation of uh, the, the struggle within or ghost head or whatever you want to call it, there are actually two Alyssas. In the Japanese version, Alyssa Hale from Struggle Within is called you. Why couldn't they just pick a better name? Oh wow. Lead him over here. Assuming he's gonna come this way. You know, in this game, he'll be going. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay, I have a strategy. But I don't worry. I'm gonna wait for him to kind of show up. map or just chill here for a little bit yeah okay yes we will yeah I remember the spot let's look over here reasons. Now I remember when, Oh shit. Okay. 
Let's get out of here. Sorry, this game is confusing my booty. Go up here. Even though I do not know how good of an idea this is. Eh. Ooh, good, 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 good. She's even though he's gonna do. I think I have a strategy. Okay. Get the fuck over here! Okay, get up there. He's gonna chase me soon. Hurry! Oh, shite. Oh, no, never mind. But I only have one left, so I kind of need him... Yeah, I kind of need him to to go away. I would greatly prefer if he went away. He'll keep doing that every now and then. I don't know if it's possible for him to figure out where you are if you're going there without him knowing. Chris is a little stinking teleport. Ooh. I might have peed a little. Nothing here. Yeah, you would say that, wouldn't you? Anus is in here. Really, nothing here. Okay, go in there. Go inside. Okay, we're on the upper level now. Go dish way. Er, yeah, let's go up here. Off limits. This is usually my first part of getting stuck. Something on the other side, okay. This seems familiar. Very nice dresses. Better not touch them, I might get them dirty. Matches. I can set things on fire. That's a lovely piano. I hope I get to play it one day. There's a... I wonder who invented this instrument anyway. Lol. You have time to wonder about those kind of things, but... Ooh. Yeah, I don't really want to be over here. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. 
Let's take a breather. This is kind of like the uh, first game with the whole panic thing. Except the panic meter is like, like your health, we'll say. You just kind of need to let it sit. There's no like button to kind of decrease your uh, thingy. I'm not sure if I'm really comfortable with that level, per se, but... Of course, you can squeeze down here. Go through here. Item. Invisibility band. That'll be useful. So, we've reached, uh, okay, let's go back. Yeah, that's dumb. You can't go through the seats, but you can go down over here. No, you can't. I mean, I know the seats are up, but I mean, surely. I came through this way, didn't I? Yeah, I did. So... There may be an area over here. Oh, it's off the limits. I'm supposed to get pliers some. Uh, let me look at my inventory. Key items. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to use the... I don't remember where, though. But oh well. Oh, terrible timing. I'm just gonna escape and run back to the uh, curtain area. The music may have stopped, but that does not mean he's not chasing us. Nope, can't get through here. What did I expect? I don't even have... <laughs> I'm going to suicide. Yeah, in fact, I'm pretty sure I just heard him open the door. I am quite the positive. Oh, fuck. You're going to want to run, 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 Okay. I may have fucked it up, but... Oh, wait now. You know, he can probably smell her. Because I'm pretty sure she's wearing me. Probably would be, if he comes back, which he most likely will, I'm going to... I mean, right now we're kind of... I might actually just kind of chill here for a little bit. Yeah, he's going back. I'm ex... Oh, what do you know? I'm just going to kind of sit here for just a little bit because, and I'm pretty sure no matter if we just like sit here and be all like, lol, we're not going to do anything, I'm pretty sure he'll just be all like, eee, and not find us. I just kind of want to be safe because we, we don't have any holy water, so. I mean, the encounters are also randomized. He can come if you just kind of sit around. It's not just a progress thing, but... Yeah. Who knows? Okay, that's good enough. Now, if he comes after us, I will poo-poo all over myself. Most likely. Yeah. If they make another one, I hope they... Speak of the... Fucking, he better not be down there. I will be pissed. 
He's not, thank you. So then I can make it to... No, no. Special place, special place, special place, special place. And she's over here. And she can blood. So. It's kind of chill. If you're definitely here, we, you should definitely take note of that, being able to hide here. It's really useful. It really is. All right. And I think this is going to be over an hour, even though this is technically two separate videos. Hello, little girl. Oh, she's not here. Nope, 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 not what I want. Hold on, I need to... Ah, uh, of course. I think I got it. Okay. We need to be careful, though, because we're actually pretty vulnerable. With the lack of, uh... Things. Okay. Doesn't seem to be strange here. It's gonna fucking break though, I guarantee you. <laughs> Goodness. Some sort of oh. LOL. Go back and ra I should have done so when back when I was there. But the problem is we're heading back. You know, it's kind of like going exactly. So what I'll do is I'll just kind of jerk around for a little bit. Or oh shit! I have a feeling it was up there. Turn around, ha! Huh. Because I know a secret to getting. And on New Game Plus, they're even faster and stronger and smarter and have weapons. No, 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 no. Ha. Ass wipe. See, he's really close right now. He's even right over there. Like, I'm not even kidding. But, you stand here. And he doesn't want to go near you. I don't know why. I don't know, maybe just to give you just an easy safe place here, because you really only have like one safe place. And like he's all sniffing as like, Alyssa, where are you? But, you know. Fun fact about myself, I got this game uh, the day Media Play. Um closed down along with EverQuest 2 and of course if you've seen my previous video or my latest video I guess we'll say is the or one and if you've seen if you've seen my latest videos you will know that I am aware of EverQuest fucking next yeah this is it I'm pretty yeah You know, it's funny, in some scenes her skirt looks long, but in other scenes it looks short, like... I mean, if she is wearing it kind of high, for all we know, she could have just buttoned a few of the buttons on her shirt. Maybe she's wearing it really casually. With the power of magic, we can now walk through this thing. There's lanterns on... Yes, light using matches. What does it mean? Oh... Uh, there's the room. We can walk across here. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, sheesh. Go 
slowly. Ooh, 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 okay. Go slowly. <laughs> and what do you know? Pliers. We will need those, so we now get to go back. I'm scared. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Uh, uh, uh. I think she'll die if she falls, so. Uh, uh. Stable. <sighs> A moth. I hope it eats my clothes. I think it's over here. Too risky to cross now, well then, shiz. What, am I just supposed to go past him? I guess I'm just supposed to go past. And he's not happy, but that's okay because I can get back to the friggin' room. If I can just make it back. I should, I'm, should write a fanfic about Alyssa. Where she's doing all this stuff, but it's like... It's like just a really... Like she swears and... And all she really cares about is like, I don't know. Like, I don't know, maybe she hates her uniform. She's trying to use an excuse. But maybe she's like really fickle and I don't know why. All these moths just sitting. Oh, yeah, they are her. Leave me alone, you stinking moth! Alyssa's voice actress is doing these days. But anyway, what I was like, and but maybe like she wants to get rid of her uniform, but she wants to do it in like a really like natural way. Or I don't know. Or maybe she's just really, I don't know. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm leaving. Screw this! I don't know. Or maybe like, she wants to like just change. Yeah, use the freaking master key. Let's go. Cause now we've got the stinking pliers. We might actually beat this first level. Alisa. Wait until I get my stinking stuff first, then you can chase me. I mean, granted, I'm a bit a ways, but you can still catch up because that's how this game is. It likes to kind of cheat. Uh, okay, use it to refill. Nope. Oh, God dang it. Well, yeah, I'll save. I kind of screwed up a little bit, but... And I can come... Because we're going to be coming back here anyway. Like, I don't know. Or maybe, like, she finds a change of clothes, and she changes into it. But she doesn't know where to put her uniform, and she doesn't want to lose it because she has to go to school the next day. It's like, oh, I didn't want to lose my uniform, even though I probably have, like, five pairs of it. Stupid moth. No, 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 no. Okay, go in here. Alyssa. Yep. Alyssa, oh. Where are you? 
shit, I was scared. Because he like started charging toward us. And see our meters going higher because we are freaked the fuck out. I actually have never noticed that. I mean, I knew that if it's like in the red or close enough, like it can like trick. If, it, if you're like in panic and you try to hide, she'll just like pop out. Like the game told us. But, you know. We gotta kinda sit for a little bit, and I've got the slight hiccup, so. I don't know. This video is already over. This is my longest commentary, not gonna lie. You could almost call this a let's play. But it's not a let's play. Hello. Use the pliers. Yay. Okay. Plants. Hangers and shit. There's nothing inside, and it's a box. And they fizzle. There's a secret door here, I think. Box. Carved wooden box. Open it. Yeah. Cutscenes. Why, hello, daughter. Tell you something important. Daddy's going off to war. War? I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone. I feel dreadful. I'll be all right. But what about you? You'll miss me and be sad when you're in war, won't you? Yes, yes, I will. You're the most precious thing to me in the whole world. But don't worry. Daddy, don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve. Concourse, okay. The winner will have their performance aired on the radio. I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. That will be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. I'll practice every day. I've already chosen the piece I'm going to play. The Listen. one I keep playing. You told me this watch was a present from Mummy before you got married, remember? I'll play this tune on Christmas Eve, so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again. Assuming their mother's dead. When you've been sitting down for so long, it kind of gets a little hard to sit back up. Ain't that morbid. Yeah. We got that. Pocket watch. I'm pretty sure that's the sentimental item. I am still more inside. Hammer killer hanged. 10 September 1941, Robert Morris, 32, the man known as the Hammer Killer, has been hanged. Rumors regarding Morris's death are widespread. One witness reported he was hanged for a very long time, pulling on the straps and making unearthly noises, and blood was oozing through the black cape cap. The stench was horrible. Some witnesses faded and were carried out. Morris's first victim was Tony Flanagan. 35, a fellow employee at the Banbury Stone Cutting Factory. On 6 June 1940, Moore suddenly struck Flanagan in the head with a hammer, killing him instantly. All five workers present 
All five workers present were killed in the same manner. Morris disappeared thereafter. A string of similar crimes occurred until the time of Morris's arrest on 6th March in Arlington, 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 Hampshire, Hampshire. Morse's victims number 12, and no clear motive has been determined. Specialists continue to be baffled by the seemingly abrupt change in his behavior, as well as his extreme violence of his, as well as the extreme violence of his crimes. I don't remember figuring out why he kills people either. But. Freaking picture. Maybe I can save May if I get her father's pocket watch to her. I have to take the pocket watch to the concert hall. Okay. Basically, stuff we already know. The piano must have been used for practicing on. I think at this point, the random encounters of the hammer dude will stop. Because we're actually near the end of this. This is actually the first time I've done it by myself. Because the first time I did, I got stuck here. But... Two more left. I will save as well. And after I beat it, I'll probably call it here because this thing's already an hour long. I mean, that was the point. And usually I try to at least have some sort of, like, closure and completion. And, like, showing, like, a portion of the game. But, let's refill, and let's save, because I'm pretty sure a boss is coming up. This is so similar to a Let's Play. I'll have to make sure the audio is timed accordingly. And this one in particular is longer than the other one. Okay, let's continue onward. Yep, here we go. Oh, hi there. First boss. Dun 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 dun. Boss battles. Controlling let's left hand off stick. Duck. Shoot arrow. Da -da -da. Special attack. Oh my goodness. In order to defeat the enemy, Alyssa must first transfix it. By hitting the enemy with a charged arrow, hold on X, it is possible to fix them in to the spot. Several strategically placed chains will transfer the target. Aim so that the chains fan out from the target, who should be the center. No strategy. When the enemy is transfixed, Alyssa will, is able to carry out a super attack. It is no easy task, however, to hit the target with the arrow. Watch the enemy's movements closely and wait for your chance. Duck can be used to avoid can be used to avoid attack by certain enemies. It may also cause them to become careless and vulnerable to attack. Maybe if Alyssa was a martial artist and could use like an uppercut, press the R1 button to use special arrows such as the repellent arrow in order in the order in which they were obtained. It is wise to save these f weapons for special occasions. So we look at the controls one more time. Charged arrow. Okay. I think I got it. Oh my. She gets that thing. Or no, that's something she's already had. And 
now it becomes a bow. That'd be cool if it was just a sword. I remember the first time I was like, oh, that's cool, I get to use a sword, sweet. So she's the first clock tower character to actually have a weapon to fight with, from what I can tell. Sledgehammer. Sledgehammer. Victims, 26. Sentence, 2. 486 years, that's his HP. Not judgment. Yeah, and now we have an HP bar. We're doing a little bit of damage. This, this is essentially just how you play it. Just kind of have to keep hitting him. Oh, shite. Good God, he had that. You can literally keep doing this. The only thing I have to worry about is if he does that like super move again. Mm. Motherfucker, I'm fucking you up! You! Mm. The Meteor of Pegasus! That's more like Pegasus rolling crush. So yeah, he's kind of dead. We just used a super move on him. <laughs> you bitch. You are dead. And like I said, I don't think he learned his motive. It must be one of those like story significant kind of things. So, but we do get an item. It looks like. Clover of Love. Hi. You can get an extra thingy. What's what does the Clover of Love say? They're not files, key items. Okay, so it's just like a little equipment thing. Okay. Now let's go give the pocket watch to May, and we will be done with this level. I'm gonna save here just in case shit goes down. Save the data. This boss was a lot easier than I remember. Probably because I remember the last boss. Whew! I will say, even though it doesn't seem like it, yes, this game does tie to the original. Like, this literally is Clock Tower 3. It's not like an original thing. It doesn't have Scissor Man, no. But... It does tie into the series. I'll explain it in the recap. Okay. Cutscene time. is dead. There was an explosion. A shell. I'm so sorry. Please don't cry. I understand how you feel. 
I never even knew my father. I lost him soon after I was born, but I love my grandfather just the way you love your father. He had this watch as a memento. Gee, I wonder what happened to Alyssa's father. Piano as hard as you can. You know that would make him happy. playing has brought me back to you. At last, we can be together again. Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye, May. Goodbye, Mr. Norton. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, no, she died. No, she didn't. It was all a dream. She's back in her dorm room. What's that? Have I been dreaming? You have. <laughs> nah, just kidding. She's back in her uh little uh house. Essentially. So we'll save the data. Not that it really matters. But yeah. Hope you enjoyed this extra long commentary of Clock Tower Three. It's gonna be the last one I do for a while and I'll explain why later on, but hope you enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah. This is Flamesaron, aka YouTube Stasuke, signing out. See you later.